Hi. So I want to talk to you all about two different types of images um, or file types. So you have what you call a PNG and you also have what you call a SVG. Your PNG is your portable graphic format and your SVG is your scalable vector graphic. Now, of the two, when you're working in Cricut Design Space, one is editable and one is not. The one that is editable is the SVG, the Scalable Vector Graphic. The PNG, the Portable Graphic Format, is not editable. So <clears throat> when you look at the two images on my screen, the one that has the gray top on is a PNG. The one that has the blue top on is an SVG. Okay? So when you look over to the right side of your screen, you can see that the PNG, which is what I have highlighted here, the PNG is a cut and print. And that's pretty much all you can do with that file. You can actually, um, when you make that project, you can print it out in your printer. It's gonna look just like what you see on the screen. And then you can put it into your cutting machine and it's going to cut your image out as you see it. However, when I click on the image on my left side, which is the SVG, you notice that it is a cut file only, which means that it is going to cut this file out and it doesn't matter what colors you show on the screen, it just de depends on what colors you have on your mat when you place the mat into the cutting machine. So here you have the ability to edit this particular file. So you can change the, anything that you see here on the right side, you can change the color, okay? So let's say that I wanted to change the lips and when I click them, you can see that it's going to put a little border around the lips to let you know that that is what you are working with at this time. When you look up at the top for the coloring next to your line type, when you click on that, it gives you options and choices of what you can select for the lip color. So if I wanted to make her lips yellow, then I would just click yellow and her lips would be yellow. If I wanted to change the color of her top, then I would again select the image, go over to the right side, highlight the blouse, go back up to near your line type and choose the color. So now she has yellow lips and a yellow blouse. Okay, so again, it doesn't matter what color you select here. It just depends on what color vinyl you are using on your mat or your cutting machine when you cut this image. So again, you have a PNG, which is going to be listed as a cut and print when you upload it into Cricut Design Space. And then you also have what you call an SVG, which is an editable file which is considered a cut when you upload it into Cricut Design Space. So I wanted to take this time to point out the difference between a PNG file, portable graphic format, versus an SVG, scalable vector graphic. So when someone is asking you, or you're having complications in Cricut Design Space, and someone is asking you what type of file is it, then you will know you know, not by looking at the file type, but you can see here, um, just based on what I've explained to you between the difference of a SVG and a PGF, the difference once it's uploaded into Cricut Design Space. So when you're purchasing files from, you know, people that create these different files and you want to be able to edit that file in Cricut Design Space and change around the colors and things of that nature, you want to make sure that you're working with an SVG and not just a PNG, okay? So if you have any questions, comments, concerns in reference to the different um, types of images that you can upload into Cricut Design Space, feel free in reaching out so that we can help you along the way. Again, each one teach one. Have a great day, guys.